Hello dear viewer, I'm Lee Sus. Welcome back to House Garden Flipper. Uh, been a while since I've played this, but I've got a few updates for you on this one. I haven't actually done much off screen. I did a little bit, but not very much. So, so, first of all, before I do anything else, um, about the videos and the quality of the videos, I want to apologise for some of the earlier videos in the series here. I had some real graphical glitches and I couldn't work out what they were. So it was particularly, I'm really hoping that as I do this that it's not going to happen again. But as I was doing this sort of movements, rapid movements like this, I was getting graphical glitches on on, on the recording. Now, it wasn't on, actually, it wasn't on the recording. So the recording is on OBS. The editing is on Windows Media Player, the older one, which is actually fine. Um, new one's not necessary. The old free one. So if you ever do any videos, that's a perfectly good um, editing soft piece of editing software. That one, it was okay. It was okay on on the view that I saw for editing on Media Player, Media Player. And it was only when I did the encoding for upload to YouTube, not YouTube itself, but the encoding button, me, that I had problems and I couldn't work out what it was. But I would get like everything would break up into pixels briefly and then come back into focus again, and I couldn't work out why because I had some I record at fairly high resolution. And then I, um, and I encode at high resolution as well. And I couldn't work out. I finally got a setting on there that seems to work, but I'm not really sure. It's even higher setting than it basically is. But hopefully now by doing this, you won't see that. You'll see, you'll have seen it on a couple of videos. Um, the previous one we saw with the Christmas house, the side quest, the, uh, the side mission, it shouldn't be on there. Okay. So just to let you know that I'm aware of these things I see them after I've recorded them and it frustrates me because I can't go back and redo the recording all I've got in stuck is with this recording that and I don't want to upload again uh, I get stuck with this with this problem with the quality anyway so that's that first thing done next a little bit of a change in here this device here so um I suddenly realized doing work in here that I'd forgotten a few things that I would typically have in a kitchen and in my kitchen, well, not in my kitchen, but in the, the room next to the kitchen, I have a washing machine and I have a dishwasher. Well, a washing machine and a dryer. And the dishwasher goes... It's not the typical piece of white goods that goes in a kitchen, as far as I'm concerned. But something about this game, they like to put them... First of all, they, 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 they like to leave big gaps around them, so I can't really squeeze things up any, any more than this and still have the cabinets up against the wall. And this, this big gap down the back, it just annoys me how it sticks out so much. I don't know why. And the other thing with this game is obsession with putting putting washing machines in the bathroom. Is that is that a European thing? I don't get it. I mean, I get sort of understand it that the, you, you need a water supply for your washing machine. And one of the places to get your water supply is in your bathroom. You know, the, water, the pipes come in here, the waste pipes and the water pipes are in here. But they're also in the kitchen. So I don't really know why. It, I mean, if it was a first floor, if it was a two floor house second it's two two story house then your main bathroom is usually upstairs isn't it therefore your washing machine had to be upstairs i'm not going to carry a washing machine up i probably could I've, I've moved enough washing machines around in my life but i don't think i want to carry upstairs to install it anyway um ah, blathering on so so the fact is i had wanted to put this in but i had to rearrange some of the cabinets to do it which frustrated me a little bit but it all fits in so it's all in here and then i realized i'd also forgotten the tower radiator in, in here as well so just a few little bits of it otherwise I haven't done very much I cleared some trees out here is what I did um, there was somewhere too close to the house and I put some turf down and the turf is a little bit better but it's still doing wacky things occasionally here and there um, and if I can't you can't put turf under bushes still so I have to probably clear these bushes out and maybe put them back off I wish I could just move these bushes but there we go like we can with everything else but okay so that's about all I've done Okay, so what we're going to do today, though, is... Looks at how long the video's been running already. Um, oh, my, my bag just fell over in my, in my room. <laughs> it's, it's, even my bag is bored, bored by, my, by my wittering on. And what we're going to do today is the bedroom, and I've realised this is a real problem. In my head, I remember this being this room being a little bit bigger than this. And I think the problem is going to be, actually, this door. So... I'm going to try something first, okay? This is the master bedroom, and it's not very big at all, is it, really? Um, and it's also restricted severely by this and this. So, if, for example, if we get a bed, if we get a bed in here, um, 
what are beds even under? I can't what category they're under, just furniture probably. Let's just get, no, not flower beds. Oh, we're on flower section. That doesn't help very much, does it? Uh, <laughs> let's just do bed. Bunk beds, um, just double beds, double bed pattern. There we go. What is this under? I oh, just under furniture. Okay. So let's find a nice bed for, remember, a young couple with, uh, with a couple of, couple of, couple of young, young, youngish children. What would be a nice bed for them to have? Not too expensive. A moderately priced bed. Oh, that's one actually. This one's kind of nice. That's that's nice. Let's um. Let's go with. I don't actually know what kind of the kind of the room's going to be yet. Oh, that's a nice swirly pattern on there. Ooh. Oh, it's that pattern. Ah, oh, I kind of like that one. And uh, the bedding itself. Oh, too much choice. Um. Hmm. Yeah, blue bedroom at this rate. No. No. That goes... There we go. And what sort of wood is it going to be in here? It's going to be carpet on the floor. Sure. Right. It's where it's going to fit in. So, I won't want to have a bed with the back to the window. And I can't move this window door thing over here. So, we do put it here. Okay, if it goes up against the wall, this is not great because, of course, somebody, usually Dad, I would imagine, is going to be up against the wall and can't get out. So roll out of bed to the to the other side. So you put it in the middle like this, but then you're restricting things for cupboards. I guess we could put it here. So the question is, if I was to move this, oh, you lot on the left, shut up for goodness sake. Um, if I was to put the doorway here. Mm, even if I was to put the doorway there. Oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What if I put the doorway here? What difference does that make? I could have the bed. So the bed could be here, like this. Bit of a gap on that side. Like here. Doorway on that side, but then where the cupboard's going to go. Now, I think this is going to go here. Which is not great. It's centered under the window. I think that will do. And then cupboards either side of the door, probably, I'd imagine. Not a lot of, maybe another one here. Not a lot of space. Don't put the hammer away, me. I know I know you're frustrated. But put the put the hammer away. Uh furniture. What we want is cupboards. I don't search the subcategories, I think. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm trying to choke myself. Ah, standard four-door wardrobe. What are we going to be in here? <clears throat> These ones aren't very expensive. We get out. This is like a... doesn't make me think of wardrobe here, which is a cabinet. <clears throat> Definitely killing myself here. Excuse me. Coffee, coffee's going the wrong way. <clears throat> um, yeah, I don't want a desk like that in the room. We want standard sort of wardrobes. Hmm, hmm. Modern family. Ikea type look, maybe. Chairs and things. Um, these are so boring, though. Stylish? Rather expensive. I mean, it might... Mm, I guess I would pay 888 euros for a, for a cupboard like that. A, a different, with a different wood, but... Uh, but these are not like these. This is memories of... This is memories of childhood. Of the crappy, crappy wardrobes. Um... Oh, isn't choosing the same things is the problem? These aren't too bad. Some of these? Why am I pondering some? Why is this such a, such a crisis for me? Getting the right wardrobe. I don't know. Um, how many Hermes are there? Let's have a look. Because they're all part of sets. It's nice to have a Hermes. Oh, it's a double bed Hermes as well. Is that what we're using? No, it's not what we're using, is it? But these will do, I guess. Let's buy... Ving. Wing. Let's buy um buy many of these. Oh come on. What's your what's your problem? What are you what are you oh you are clashing with the wall. There we go. One Two. Yeah, it's not a lot of room in here, is it really? Hmm. 
three. Oops, I don't really like it. <laughs> I'm not happy. I'm not happy, but then there's not a lot of room down here to walk around the bed. Um, I think I'll have to do though. Maybe we should get rid of this one and put a put a. Let's just move it over here for a second, like that, and we'll try. Oh god! See, this is what annoys me. They're both Hermes, but they're not the same colour. I guess, yeah, th this is nut and this is walnut. I guess is the difference. Like that. The door's going to bang on this as it opens, isn't it? I know it doesn't always open like that, but I thought that's what's going to happen. Also, is that bad to have a, a couple of... Would you feel like, if you were going to roll over in bed and you had a cupboard next to you, would you feel like you were going to roll up and hit your head on it? Hmm. Not much I can do about that, really. This thing probably needs to go as well. Okay, let's get rid of this as well. There we go. And what kind of doors was I doing in here? I was doing white doors. Okay. Um, I'm going to change that then. Yeah, I was even... even in the early days of doing this, I was even thinking about... Um, wardrobe doors and things and that's never going to happen what I seen did I see these before how did I not see these in the kitchen these could do with some of these in the kitchen actually did I put some of those up already mm. I can't remember um distracted I know I'm sorry uh bye now let's put one of those in there there okay just satisfy my curiosity I didn't why did I not see one of those cupboards Let's go back one. That's nice. Um, it's green. No, it's white. With green doors like that. Isn't that what it is? It's a grey. No, it's white White back. Okay. Um, not the best place for it, is it really, over the table? But I guess it might do. We could put some up here. It's awkward, wouldn't it? You'd have to lean over the table to try and reach the stuff in the cupboard. But there's not a lot of choice where else we can put these. Let's buy another one. One more? Sure, why not? Oh, there's a lot of space in the kitchen. Okay, I'm happy with that. Um, let's see in here. So, um, what, what have we got? We've got blue and white and the yellow. Does the yellow go? Not really. Be nice to be able to, to be able to change these after something you've already bought. Wouldn't it? Something you've already bought, but never mind. A carpet. That's what I need. Uh, floors. Uh, floor tiles. No. Rugs. No. But floor tiles. I guess that's what it counts as. Is it for the carpet one? No. Floor panels and coverings. So I think that's what we saw in that in the Christmas house when I was admiring the floor in the bedroom. Not a lot of choice with the carpets. Which is annoying. But there we go. Mm, that's alright, I guess. I want some more colourful walls, though, because I feel that the, the, the room is very... Um, very drab so far. Uh, paint. Oh, these colours. Um, is that going to be too much? Hmm. Maybe. But we're going to do it anyway. We're going to do it anyway. So what I want is... Is that the one I was looking at? Purple quartz? Yeah, I'll have one of those. And we'll have... That might be too dark, but we'll see. Let's see how it looks. I was thinking of one feature wall over here. Like that. 
By the way, uh, you might notice my, my far more healthy bank balance on the right hand side. I did a few more jobs, as I said I would off camera, to uh, help with that. This might be, I think this is going to be too dark. A paler blue might be what we need. That's a little overwhelming in a small room, isn't it really? Let's give her a lighter blue. A sleepy blue. Oops. Oh, balance it on the edge of the bed. Sure, me. Why not? What could possibly go? That'll do. Let's see how it looks as we get the room done. How are you doing anyway? I don't think this is going to get done by Christmas, unfortunately. It's nearly Christmas. It's Christmas Eve Eve at the moment. If that makes sense, which it probably doesn't. Um, and, um, yeah, I thought about getting this house done before then, but I'm, I've been busy with other stuff. Well, busy's a subjective term. I've been doing other stuff. <laughs> Whether I've been busy or not, <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's certainly someone else will have to judge that, I think. I've been doing other things. Um, so, well, I might put some Christmas decorations in here, just a little bit, just to make it feel nice, but, um, yeah, we'll see. What I might do is actually add a couple of paler blue stripes, possibly, to make the room feel a bit less dark in here. Yeah, so Christmas is coming up. Very, very close. I hope you're looking forward to it. And uh, if you don't celebrate Christmas, happy holidays. And if you're not on holiday, well, sorry about that. Let's hope you're... As long as you're happy and healthy. That That is, after all, the important thing, isn't it, really? Uh, a paler blue. How about a sky blue? That is probably the wrong sort of colour. Mm, could do it anyway. So I just better do these, just do these things and see how it turns out. Yeah, so uh, yeah, Christmas will be along soon. It'd be nice to uh, open the presents, and I'm just worried about doing the dinner. That's the only thing I've got to worry about really is uh, make sure I get the dinner right. My preparations for that. As for the presence of things, I'm not too worried about that. My wife did say the other day, she asked us all to say, you know, what, um, we were out, we were out in London having, uh, to see the lights and, um, have a meal out just to go and do something for the holidays. And my wife asked everyone to say, yeah, "What are you? What are you looking forward to? What is, what's your what are you looking forward to for the for Christmas and things like that?" And I I couldn't really think of anything particular apart from, as I say, getting the getting the dinner dinner right and everyone being happy with it. But the uh, I didn't ask for anything particular How about that one. There we go. I never asked for very much as far as presents or anything like that, so I'm not looking forward to a particular present. Or anything like that. Is this madness? Have I done something terrible in here? Um, you know what I might do actually. I don't know. I think I'm going to go with it anyway, just to make the room look a bit more colourful. Let's put a nice um. Oh, you know what? Can we fit the curtains up while they clash with the bed? Hmm. I'm not very fond of doing bedrooms. Is part of the uh, thing. I don't. I'm not. Oh. I said about lack of curtains and things, didn't I? Oh, a blind. Oh. Oh, does it? Yeah. How does this work then? Pretty similar, exactly the same way you do the curtain. Well, not quite. Similar. Similar to how you do the curtains. Let's see, how this, see how this looks. That's all right. It's not the colour's not quite right, but that's my fault, rather than a problem with the uh, thing. And blinds are modern. I don't like to have blinds. Yeah, the colour's not right, but I kind of like that. And we want another one. We want another. I actually might tote those down. I think I might. I think I'm actually going to go for traditional curtains because not that I don't like the blinds. Uh, I'm not very fond of Roman blinds. I'd rather have wooden blinds, like these ones here, 
more of these options for you. But never mind. Um, but uh, I want curtains for the um, for the door, and therefore I want matching curtains for the window. So. wide that one there I think that's the one we're after I think flowers is going to be too much to have flowers on there as well when the walls are really quite busy um ah, I can't put one over here then oh I probably can't because it's got because it hits against the wall oh that's annoying Okay, um, short, wide, I think, is what we want now. What's it clashing with everything, probably? If I move this, and I move this over here, let's, can we get the curtains in? Or see if it's going to clash with the bed it's clashing with. No, there we go. Okay, let's get these up here. You'd need you'd need some curtains. I'll have to leave the guys to the new owners of the house to put some curtains up over over the door because it's going to be too bright, isn't it? Really, I think. Where can we get this fitted in? There. Yeah. That's not too bad, I guess. That's okay. Um, how about a nice painting on the wall? What about that? Um. Decorations, probably. What's it under? Painting. Yeah, some decorations. Okay. So, we have looked at the new plants. I've had this. Must be loads of, loads of new plants. What sort of picture would we like in here? Um, oh. The posters and things are not what I'm after, but okay. Um, oh, look at that little set of herbs and things. Oh, I could have that in the. I have a little herb garden outside the. Uh, outside the kitchen. That'd be nice. But. I think. I don't know what I'd want in here. I know what sort of painting I'd like, but I don't think. That's not what I should be putting up. I should be putting up something that I think other people would like. Um, how big is this? Oh, tiny. Okay. <laughs> Some sizes would be nice as well, wouldn't it, really? And they're all tiny. Why are they... Well, I'm not going to do it by the price. How about if I sort by the... No, descending. Hmm. Also not very big. I want a nice big painting. We could put a couple of paintings up, I guess. Couldn't we, really? I don't know. Uh, I'm just... Uh, hmm. I think it's maybe the colours that are upsetting me more than, than trying to get a painting to fit. How about that? We'll have that one, and we'll have the, uh, the, 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 the one at the bottom. There we go. Or the water lilies. Bottom or water lilies. Let's have a bottom. There we go. Hmm. I'm not happy. I'm not happy, but I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna just deal with it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> How about so we go back to decorations again? We look for Oh no, this is nice. There we go. How about nice orchid? Are you gonna go up there? I worry about that falling on my head in the middle of the night, but <laughs> you probably won't. We'll put it over here. There we go. That's alright. That's okay. How is it in here? Eh. Oh, we're missing a light. We could probably do with a light up there. That'd be nice. How about that? Um, 
have some side lights. We could have um, just a main light. How about a main light? What sort of main light should we have? Yes, this one. That'll be okay. Yeah. And probably a light switch. Might be nice. Yes, yeah, so I'm not um That's okay. 